Hi, I'm Judith Monroe, and I'm working in the studio today. Yesterday, I um, put all of these images onto this great big panel. This is um, three foot by four foot, and you can see there's um, nine different sections of image that I put on there. So I did that one yesterday, and I did this one yesterday as well. And transferring those images only took me about, oh, four and a half hours or so. So, you know, um, <laughs> uh, it was cool because some of the time I was on a Zoom call. So multitasking. And today I'm going to start putting colored pencils on both of these. Okay, and I have to show you this. That is my um, poor pitiful dog, Mo. We walked, so now he's tired, and um, he'll just sack out there while I work here. So um, I've brought my colored pencils over here and um, my reading glasses because I need them now when I do this. And um, I got a whole bunch of new pencils recently. These are all um, Marshalls. They are specially made for painting coloring on photographs. And I've always liked my Marshalls pencils, but I never had very many. Like, I think before this I had a dozen. Um, and some of these are duplicates. So before I start, I'm actually gonna um, make sure that I don't put any duplicates in here. I have another place where I put my um, duplicates so that when I run out, I have it handy. Um, but I'm not gonna make you watch me do that. But aren't they pretty? I just think they're so pretty. All right, suffice it to say I have plenty of pencils now. I mean, I didn't have a problem with that before. And now I'm just gonna start to get to work with, um, uh, filling in the little gaps so that these spaces won't be distracting. So I have to say, this is one of the most ingenious um, inventions ever. So when I'm working with a really short pencil like this, it starts to get kind of hard. My fingers will cramp up because it's so short, but um, there's still a lot of pencil left here. And these things, you know, cost money. We won't talk about how much always, but because um, that would be depressing how much money I have sitting there. But anyway, um, this, and I had to put a little piece of tape on it, but this fits right in here. This snugs up, and now I have this fabulous um, little holder for my pencil. And um, if you're looking to get one, that says on it, ko i -nor. I'm sure I Googled it at some point in time and found it. So you could do the same. Anyway, pro tip for the day. So now you can see um, we don't really see those hard um, broken lines through there anymore. It's not like it's perfect. Like if we're really looking, there's still that there. But it's just now that from a distance, those um, flaws are not so much so that they draw our attention too much. Um, I actually kind of like them when they're there. Um, I just don't want them to take away too much attention. So I'm going to go do the same thing on that piece. Um, so you see, you know, there's those bright white lines. They're really calling our attention. So I'm going to take that away and then I'll come back and then I'll start adding color and um, it'll be another day in the studio.
So, this is going to go on for a while. Until next time, like, subscribe, and comment. Thanks.